what was normal 20-30 years ago, but is considered a luxury now. Getting things repaired instead of buying new. Good quality fabric in clothing. I have clothes from the 90s and 80s from my mother that still hold up today. These days, I'm lucky if my shirt isn't saggy and misshapen within a year. Privacy. Items not requiring a subscription each month. Calling a company and getting a person on the other end of the phone. Farmers markets. You used to be able to go down and get fruit and vegetables cheaper than the grocery store. Now it seems like they charge 3x more than stores do. Getting a handwritten letter. Legroom on an airplane. Being able to afford having only one person working in a relationship. Single income families buying a home. Retirement plan built into your job. Pork belly. Used to be a bad cut of meat that was disposed of or given to the poor for dirt cheap prices. Then rich people realized that the poor made it delicious. Which then caused prices to skyrocket. Family vacations. I remember going on road trips regularly and even flying once or twice as a kid. Now that I have kids there's no way I can afford a week-long trip to the Badlands. Grand Canyon, Disney, Universal Studios etc. Best I can do is a day trip to the Dells maybe once a year. A company-funded pension plan in the private sector. My wife's grandmother retired from one of our local health insurance companies over 30 years ago. With a full pension. She's 91 and still receives her pension. Although the insurance company was acquired by a larger organization a few years back. It's a modest pension, but it allows her to live a comfortable and independent life. Nowadays, companies only offer 401k or similar retirement plans. Outside of education, government. Very few private sector companies offer pension. I'm fortunate enough to be employed by one that still does. Not being expected to be reachable 24-7. A single family detached house. Being able to buy a decent standard home on one modest salary. Word used to be just installed with your Microsoft software. Now you have to pay each month per year. Games that released mostly complete, stable, games that didn't have microtransactions games that are not live service garbage that dies less. Then a year later games that you unlock content cosmetics through actual L playing the game. And not by excessively grindy progression systems. To entice you to buy XP boosts it time skips. Or by microtransactions. Being able to go out every Friday after work and being able to afford it. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Aircast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.